Hi, so um, do you have any idea on about CAPS? Uh, it's like service? <laughs> Familiar, but I forgot the acronym. <laughs> CAPS? CAPS. CAPS? CAPS. C A P S. CAPS is in the CAPS. CAPS in UPL. No, the CAPS. CAPS. Counseling. Yeah, counseling and psychological service. During my high school days, I've encountered the counseling thing, the guidance counselor. How about? Yeah. I think so. No. CAPS, no. Not me. Um, they give advice. Oh, no, no. For example, you have problems. <laughs> so if you seek for advice, I think you're going to go there or something, or if you're involved with something like um, a commotion, you have to go to the guidance counselor. <laughs> I'm not sure. No. So yeah. No, here in South Bay. Yeah. No, because I'm a new student. <laughs> So what is CAPS? CAPS means Counseling and Psychological Services. CAPS is located at the second floor of the college building. The CAPS office consists of a counseling room, a waiting area, A testing room, CAPS is a student-friendly environment and it is a place where students can engage themselves into different services that would make them better and well-rounded individuals. The services that CAPS offers are orientation, Psychological testing or assessment. Group counseling. Individual counseling. Mentoring Career Guidance or Placement Services College Comprehensive Growth Series and outreach programs. CAPS also includes the seven institutional courses, namely IC1, SISC Hallmarks, IC2, Intrapersonal and Interpersonal Relations. IC3, Values Development IC4, Achiever Score Training IC5, Professional and Social Graces IC6, Leadership IC7, 5Cs in the Workplace